This was Norman's locker. The door was dented like someone had punched it. I don't remember him doing that when we, w we worked there. Yo-ho! I like to push it. A utility shelf, cramped with mismatched tools and items. There was a claw hammer on the shelf. Did I take the hammer? As I took the hammer, I noticed it wasn't a dusty, as dusty as the rest of the tools on the shelf. Na, haben wir damit irgendjemand im Kopf eingeschlagen, oder was? Hier ist schon wieder so ein Locker. The locker was a complete mess. Hidden at the bottom, though, was a magnetic card. Did I take the card? Joho! I slipped the keycard into my pocket. So, und hier haben wir noch ein weiteres Panel. Das ist immer noch rot. Ja, doch. So, jetzt aber. Und du willst auch noch. Ja, bitte, danke. So, ich glaube, jetzt haben wir alle, oder? Dann haben wir jetzt auch die Magnetkarte. Wir haben die Tür aktimalisiert. Das heißt, wir können wieder runter. Weil weiter rauf ging es ja auch, glaube ich, gar nicht mehr, oder? Na, die Tür ist leider auch zu. Immer noch. So, dann. Gucken wir mal. Hier war, glaube ich, die Magnetkarte, oder? Wenn ich das richtig gesehen habe. Ja. The keycard I found seemed like it would pass through this reader. Did I use the keycard? Ja, natürlich. Hallo? Die Neugier siegt. Ah, hier ist was. Hier ist nichts. There was some kind of ventilation hatch there. It looked like I could jump to the room below. My leg hurt enough as it was, but I couldn't see another option. Did I jump? Nee, erstmal nicht. If I was too chicken to jump down that broken ladder before, why do it now? There had to be another way. Warte mal, warte mal, warte mal. Nein! Crap! Shit, muss ich da jetzt runterspringen? Mist. Fuck. Ich will doch noch da runter. Na ja, gut, da muss ich wohl runterspringen. Oh man, my leg hurt like hell. Ja, super. Crap. There was a crumpled up ladder on the floor. It had been scratched out heavily and it was hard to make out. Did I try to read the letter? Yeah. Most of the letter was violently scratched out with what looked like to be a ballpoint pen. All I could make out was need to. Just don't. Drinking. Need. Norman. Who was Norman writing to? Keine Ahnung. Ah, shit. That poor guard. Was the flashlight I carried his? It looked like he had met his vi end violently. I only hoped it was quick. I had to get home to Rachel, but I couldn't stop thinking about Norman. He and Rachel were friends. Could he help? It wasn't like I really had anyone else to turn to. My leg burned with pain. I only hoped I could find my way through the dark path before me and get to Norman's store. Ach, shit. Jetzt kommen wir natürlich auch nicht mehr zurück. Ja. Yeah. Damit, okay, dann kann ich euch leider den einen Raum doch nicht zeigen, Mist. Gut, aber das ist das Spiel. Also deswegen, dann eben muss man es nochmal spielen, um diesen Raum hier zu sehen. Das kann man so alles nicht vorhersehen. Oh, was haben wir denn hier Schönes? Ja, jetzt fehlt uns zwar ein Hinweis, aber vielleicht... Ja, mal gucken. The garbage bin was, was a disgusting mess of rotten food and slick black bags. I saw a thin greenish corner poking out from one of the bags. It was my driver's license. It looked damaged. Did I take it back? Yeah. I cleaned the card off as best as I could. It looked pretty beat up. I was amazed to have found my credit card and now this. I tucked the card into my wallet next to my credit card. Gut, dann haben wir die auch wieder eingesammelt. Sounded like it was going to start raining again. Na, wie du das alles hören kannst, das ist ja ein Traum. I had entered Norman's place. This was the back of the store that he ran. It was oddly quiet, except for the faint sound of a television. 
Okay, das ist vielleicht auch der Store von dem einen Bild oder so oder von dem einen Zeitungsausschnitt. Ich weiß schon gar nicht mehr, was es war. Das, der uns so bekannt vorkam. The entrance to the front of the store was locked from the inside. Looked like I couldn't just pop it open. It needed a key. There was a bit of blood on the keyhole. Na super. Schon wieder Blut. Äh, gehen wir erstmal nach links, glaube ich. Oh shit. Sieht nicht gut aus. Da ist der Fernseher. The TV still flickered some indecipherable channel. Oh crap. Ich glaube, wir haben Norm gefunden. Oh no, I couldn't believe what I was seeing. Norman, my co-worker and one of, my, of the few friends I had in this town lay dead beside his armchair. His face and shirt were covered in blood. It looked like he'd been shot trying to get up. His eyes were still wide with shock. Norman, you deserved better than this. Did I close his eyes? Yeah. I wasn't sure if I wanted to give him peace or if I just couldn't stand to think any more about what was going on. Quickly, I, close, I closed Norman's eyes. Na toll. I guess this was Norman's kitchen table. He kept it clean enough, but there were water rings from two cups still there in the wood. The kitchen trash bin smelled fresh. I didn't dig through that mess, did I? Natürlich, immer rein. I found a hairpin amongst the rotting food and trash and pocketed it. Okay, wozu auch immer man eine Haarnadel braucht, eigentlich ja nur um Schlösser zu knacken. Oh, da oben ist noch was. What was this? It looked like a pull chain hanging from the ceiling. I wondered where it led. Did I pull the chain? Yeah. I gave the chain a single tug and a simple folding ladder to the attic popped down. Geil. Da war ich vorher, glaube ich, noch gar nicht. Das Ding ist mir nie aufgefallen. Oh, oh. There was a large cardboard box that hadn't been sealed. Did I open it? Ja, yeah, jetzt bin ich mal gespannt. Inside the old cardboard box was a pile of clothes, e photos and even shoes. As I looked closer, I realized they were Rachel's. What were you doing here, Rachel? Were you responsible for poor Norman downstairs? Ach du Schande. Was ist das? Nein, da war doch noch irgendwas Braunes oben, oder? Oder ist das einfach nur die Leiter gewesen? Achso, das leuchtet gleichzeitig auf. Okay. Recht noch sowas Braunes. Ich dachte, das können wir uns auch noch anschauen. Oder hat Norman Rachel getötet? I wasn't entirely surprised to find the... this here? What? It was one of Rachel's old fall coats. I always wondered what happened to it. How long had it been there? Inside the cabinet was a small but impressive collection of hunting rifles, shotguns and even a few items I didn't think were legal here. One of the slots on the rack was empty. The gun I had found seemed to match the others there. If the handgun was Norman's, what the hell was he doing with it? The gun would fit there. Did I place it back in the cabinet? Um, yeah. I carefully pushed the piece back in place and felt a great burden lifted. Okay. Gut, aber können wir jetzt noch irgendwas tun? Weil... Wir müssen ja hier irgendwie raus und wir brauchen ja eigentlich noch einen Schlüssel oder sowas. Na naja gut, wir haben ja den Hairpin, vielleicht kommen wir damit dann raus, weil Nom hatte ja anscheinend keinen Schlüssel irgendwie bei sich. Wir müssen ja unten raus. Ich hoffe mal, dass wir damit uns den Weg irgendwie frei friemeln können. Ja, yeah, I used the hairpin to pick the lock. The hairpin snapped in half, so I threw it away. So, raus da. The general store was small, but it was clean. It had the usual things, postcards, snacks, magazines and canned goods. I never went there much. Rachel usually stopped by after work if we needed anything. 
The register was mostly empty and a fat stack of travel magazines sat beside it. The icebox seemed to be unplugged. It must have been off for a while. Most of its contents were half melted. There were various postcards from the area, especially from the tourist traps. One of the postcards showed an old black and white photo of the water tower. It looked to be in much better shape then. Naja, kein Wunder. It'd been weeks since I'd last seen Norman and finding him that way still left, left me cold. Thinking of him slumped against that chair only cemented my reassurance in getting rid of that gun. It looked like someone had taken that piece from a store, but why was it in, the in those tunnels? As I stepped outside, I recalled the dusty old box of clothes in Norman's attic. I felt like I had only discovered more questions, no answers, but I was close to home. It was time to find out the truth. Dom 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 dom. It was locked. This wasn't the right gate. Good Eden. Ja doch. Müssen wir mal die richtige... Ah, das. Sieht gut aus. Da haben wir die richtige Tür. Kann ich hier noch weitergehen? Nee. Schade. The neighborhood's local post box. A letter was sticking out, as if someone hadn't pushed it all the way in. I knew it wasn't right, but did I look at the letter? Ja, ich bin auch neugierig. The envelope was addressed to Norman. There was no return address, but the handwriting looked familiar. I took a deep breath and tore open the package. Norman, I'm sending this to you in a letter because I'm afraid to tell you this in person. What we did, well, it was wrong. My husband isn't an easy man to be with, but he is my husband and your friend. I need some time to sort this out away from you both. I'm going away for a while. I'm going to tell him, Norman, so don't you think you can hold that against me? Maybe we'll work it out. I'm not sure I even want to, but he deserves it at, le at least that much. Goodbye. Na, war das vielleicht Rachels Handschrift? Hier geht's nicht mehr weiter. Na, ist hier auch Blut wieder um, an der Wand, oder wie? Ja, das war so klar. I had entered our backyard. The rain gave me a terrible sense of foreboarding and it chilled me through my clothes. I was expectant, but also afraid. Das sieht doch alles strange aus. I held my breath as I approached my hour back door. I was terrified to step inside. Ja, hilft ja nicht, mein Freund. Jetzt geht's um die Wurst. The house was painfully quiet. The only sound was my own breathing, ragged and strained. I flicked the light switch by the door. The power was off. I remembered having breakfast here on this very table. Was that yesterday or some time, some time before? The door to the basement. It was locked. Where had I put the damn key? Schau mir mal. There was a small pile of mail on the floor in front of the mail slot. How long had I been away? Why hadn't Rachel picked this up? Most of the contents were bills. There was a credit card bill there. Did I open it? Ah. I ripped the bill open and read it. To my surprise, it said something about cancelling my credit card due to non-payment. What the hell? So, gut, dann gehen wir mal rauf. Was haben wir hier? Ist noch eine Tür? The door was stuck shut. There was an old-fashioned keyhole underneath the handle. Schlüssel, Schlüssel, Schlüssel. Ohne Ende. I had found the last missing piece from my wallet. The old photo of Rachel and I stared back at me, reminding me of better times. It didn't make me feel terribly comfortable. Did I keep it anyway? Yeah. I replaced the photo in my wallet, feeling like I had got part of my life back. Still, the image made me uneasy. Why had I thrown it away? Our television. I had purchased it before I knew I was going to lose my job. I felt pretty guilty about it afterward, but by then it was too late. Na, da hatte die Frau eventuell eine Affäre mit unserem Freund Norman. So.
so was haben wir denn hier? Oh. Our hallway mirror had been smashed. Its pieces scattered around the floor. Our sink, which needed to be replaced. One of the taps always stuck, but I hadn't got around to fixing it yet. We were lucky enough to get a house with one of those wonderful old claw foot footed bathtubs. Okay, so hier ist noch eine Tür. My laptop had been left on and only had a tiny bit of power left. On the screen was a website about the old water tower. There was a key in the top drawer of my desk. Did I take it? Ja. Yeah. I pocketed the key. Gut, dann müsste hoffentlich der Schlüssel unten passen. An der einen Tür. The books, they were half mine, half Rachel's. Hey, now that I look more closely, it looked like the man in that house had some of the same books as I did. Hm, was sagt uns das? My wife's, Rachel's suitcase was sitting on the bed. It was closed, but I had a feeling what was in it. Did I open it? Inside Rachel's suitcase were a few days worth of clothes, some personal effects and a train ticket. As I stared at the ticket, I could feel myself flush with anger and resentment. The date and time matched the receipt I had found. Hm, aber warum haben wir diese Quittung genau da gefunden? Okay, also bisher würde es ja Sinn machen, wenn Norman und Rachel eben eine Affäre gehabt hätten. Und Rachel wollte jetzt halt eben weg. Wir haben es rausgefunden, haben sie und Norman getötet, um es mal äh, brutal zu sagen. Und dann weiß ich aber nicht, wie wir, wie wir dann weiter verfahren sind, weil dann wird es ein bisschen schwummerig. Warum sind wir wieder zurück in, in die Firma? Wollten wir da Hinweise finden zu Norman und unserer Frau? Warum... Ja, warum sind wir da aufgewacht, wo wir aufgewacht sind? Also, das ist so ein bisschen mh, sehr strange. Warum, ja, warum haben wir die, ähm, wenn wir das überhaupt waren, warum haben wir die Camperinnen getötet? Also, solche Sachen, das ist halt so ein bisschen, na, weiß ich nicht. Also, da komme ich noch nicht so wirklich mit klar. The door was stuck shut. Ach so, dann passt der Schlüssel hier nicht, oder wie? Dann war es vielleicht der Schlüssel zum Basement. Von meinem Glück, den wir da jetzt gerade gefunden haben. Dann gehe ich nochmal runter und gucke nochmal. Das war doch jetzt hier, oder? Ja, yeah, I unlocked the basement door. There was all Christmas decorations in the box. The garbage bags were stuffed with old paint cans and supplies. There was a dirty old key here. Did I take the key? Ja. Yeah. I took the small key and tried to remember what it unlocked. Ja, wahrscheinlich die Tür da oben, die ich gerade eben versucht hatte. There were old clothes, tools and other things we obviously hadn't thrown out yet. I had put up this divider wall last summer so we could create a separate room in the basement. I hadn't finished it yet, so the door was stuck and the drywall was poorly installed. I might have been able to break through if I found something heavy enough. Gut, also brauchen wir erstmal ein Werkzeug. So, dann gucken wir. Dann müsste ja der Schlüssel hier jetzt passen, oder? The grimy key I'd found in the basement unlocked the door. Nice. It looked like the room had been tossed around. The furniture was a mess. Did somebody break in here? Na, oder wir sind ein bisschen ausgeflippt, kann ja auch sein. Oh, hier liegt was. There was an old crowbar on the floor. Did I need to take the crowbar? Ja. Yeah. I lifted the heavy crowbar. I appreciated its weight. Sehr schön, damit können wir dann die Wand da unten niederreißen. Mehr ist hier aber nichts, ne? Hm. 